Hello, everyone. Now, the Energy Policy Act of 2005 is a major change in U.S. tax legislation. It was effective January 1, 2006. And what our federal government is doing is it's incentivizing investments to reduce building energy use. And for purposes of this legislation, a building is, is defined to include its three major subcomponents, which are lighting, HVAC, meaning heating, ventilating, and air conditioning, and the building envelope. The building envelope is the external perimeter of a building and everything that touches the outside world, meaning walls, windows, doors, roof, foundation. Now, what's interesting about this legislation is the incentives are available for both new building construction and they're available for energy reducing investments made to existing buildings. And again, we're only talking about buildings and investments that reduce energy within a building, so it would not include things like landscape lighting or, 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 or investments to reduce uh, parking lot lighting and things like that, ex external parking lots. Now, these incentives are available not only for building owners, they're also available for tenants. In many situations in our country, it is the tenant that has the economic responsibility for investments in lighting and, and for heating, and often for heating and ventilating and air conditioning, uh, particularly for retail stores and malls and, and, uh, and in office buildings. So if the tenant has the economic responsibility for the energy-reducing investment, then it is the tenant that could benefit from this law.